How you doing, everyone? So I'm, I'm with uh, Mr. Martinez here. Man, you came to Kansas City just for her expo. Your story is so powerful and so inspiring. We, we, we sat and listened to your story. Amazing. So, I mean, tell the audience, you know, a little bit about your, your, your history, your background, where you came from, and, and why you're here today. Well, you know, for me, uh, my story, pretty much what a lot of people know and kind of related to is the fact that I was in the military, and uh, I was injured in Iraq in 2003, and I was 19 years old, and all of a sudden I was, I was injured. My, you know, I went from being in a completely, like, um, in shape, playing sports my whole life, and of course being a soldier, you kind of stay in solid shape to all of a sudden being a 19 year old. And I was literally, as I tell you, I was a 19 year old baby because I couldn't do anything for myself. And, I, and it was hard for me to comprehend that my mind was saying, I want to get up and walk to the other end of the room, but I couldn't. You know, I couldn't pick up the remote to change the channel on the TV. I couldn't do anything for myself. And I literally, you know, the doctors were like, well, you don't think you'll be able to do this and do that. And it just got to a point after two and a half years in the hospital, I just said, no more, you know, that this is not me. And as I was sharing, you know, I gained so much weight when I got out of the military, yeah. and I weighed 240 pounds. Now, I'm only 5'9", so, you know, 240 is not the bracket not that I was supposed to be in, yeah. exactly. And I just kind of said, you know, you know what, as people kind of associate disability, you know, with when they see kind of people that have gone through injuries or have some kind of injuries, and I just, I literally said to my doctor, I'm going to diss that this, and I have ability inside of me. And I just made a choice, and I stayed committed to it. And so, that's, you know, coming here today is just trying to inspire, like, all these individuals, so you know, whether it's men and women, you know, whether it's uh, with Hitch Fit and trying to say, you know what, I'm trying to, you know, transform, or whether it's a New Year's resolution or a summer's resolution or whatever it is, yep. get in shape, you can do it, do it for yourself, you know what I mean? And you can get up off that couch, and you can get up out of the bed, or you can take the crutches, or yep. whatever it is, and you can actually do it for yourself. And so it's important for me to essentially be an extension of what you guys do. Yep. We're in the same business, it's we're in the same build, yeah. try to allow people to tap into their powers and to tap into what they can accomplish and allowing them to actually I think what we do is actually the best part because we get to see them in their transition. And we get to work inside and turn yeah. because it starts here. You were talking about that you you had some negative happen in your life and then it's which path you choose. Yeah. And you had complete choice that where a doctor Absolutely. said, Oh, someone's gonna have to feed you. Someone's gonna be here like, nah, nah, I'm gonna feed myself. Exactly. I'm gonna do what I need to do. I mean I, don't get me wrong, I would have liked for a girl to feed me. A good looking my life feeding you. I mean what guy would you know, of course, you know but I wouldn't say that here because women would attack me. <laughs> attack me. Uh, you know, with respect, but you know, of course you're right, man. Yeah. And I think that and as I say to people all the time, we have a tendency, we live in the visual world, so we can see, you know, our appearances on the outside, we can see cars, we can see clothes, we can see roofs over our head. And the minute that we feel like we visually we can't see that anymore, we've lost it, we think that we lose everything, you know. But the biggest thing I tell people is that you still you still have that ability inside of you to make a choice. Yeah. And and sometimes in your darkest moments when things seem, you know, like they're shot to hell. If you make a choice for yourself and you stay committed and you're dedicated and you don't let anything or anybody take you away from that, you'd be surprised and you're going to surprise everybody else what you've accomplished. I mean, my doctors, as much as they love me and, and try to support me and try to give me back to 100%, to see me doing the things that I'm doing today, they're, they're like, you know what, we, 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 we never thought, we yep. never really thought, we never even thought as a burn survivor and you were in a hospital for so long that you can move around like that, that yeah. you can dance like that. You know, and this dude won dance I the stars. won. Can I mean, you like, believe what? it? As they say in Georgia, who would have thunk it, you know? So, you got all these um, Spanish women chasing him now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. You know, it's, it's, everybody now is like, oh, Dan, it's supposed to move. And yeah. I'm like, oh, my God. Yeah. But it's it's cool, man. You know, and I applaud you, you know, for what you guys are doing as well and trying to allow people to. I, know, I understand you guys are, like, supporting out to a lot of different yeah. countries around the world and doing great things, man. And just keep it up, man, you know, because I know it's amazing. Like, I've seen people, you know, personally, when they made the choice and the decision and, and, and committed to it to transform, you know, their lives physically, you know, at the end, they're like, oh my God, you, you can just see everything just changes about them, you know what I mean? And all of a sudden they feel like, oh, I can, you know, uh, you know, you know, talk to a beautiful girl, or I can go out there and wear this certain type of clothes, or I can just, for, at the end of the day, just be happy with my body and myself, and not walk past the mirror and be like, oh, get away, you know? You know, and so I applaud you guys for what oh, you're doing. Oh, man, well. you're, you're, doing, you're doing amazing things, too. Where can we find you? Uh, well, I'm on Twitter. I mean, that's Twitter, Twitter my website, yeah. uh, you know, of course, Facebook, that whole, you know, world. Okay. And my Twitter account is uh, K-N-O-W-J-R, so it's no J-R. Okay. So hit me up. And then, of course, my website as well, which is awesome. jrmartinez.com. So, you know, just, uh, you know, I'm out there floating around just trying to do the same thing, man. Oh, so, that's awesome. Absolutely. You know what? Thank you so much. Hey, for, man, it was a pleasure, for, uh, man. For taking absolutely. the time. Check us out on hitchfit.com. Check out J.R. Martinez here. Real deal. Sweat it out. Very, <laughs> sweat if you have it negativity out. inside of you, sweat it out. That's the way to do it. Sweat Real it deal. out. All right. So, cool, all right. Man. It was Take a pleasure, care. man.